Hi, this is Lakshmi. Today I am going to explain you about how to use a variable and a parameters in the script task. Here in the script task, this is used when we want to use or write a code when it in the inbuilt function of SSIS cannot be resolved through which we cannot resolve. So, some coding should be written. In the, here in this script task, we actually write some code in vb.net or csharp.net. Here some code should be required for an SSIL developer also to write how to write this vb.net code like that. So here what I am going to do is I am going to first I am going to create a variable by right clicking on this new SSIS package. I am creating a new variable like this name and what I am going to give is a script variable the name of that variable will be and this is scope is in this package one and it is of a string and what I'm going to do is hello world so this is what it's going to uh, display here when we when we execute this then now what I'm going to I'm drag and drop in the script task here here I am I drag and drop the script task and double click over the here we will get no script task editor has been opened. Here the script language what we can see is here we be visual basic C sharp or, or we can give or visual basics also. So here what is going to do then here you can see this read only variables and rewrite variables here what if you see in rewrite variables here we will be they will be showing uh, how many variables what uh, variables we have passed here we have given the script variable one so i am checking this one so okay and next thing is what we are going to write is uh, what we are going to do is uh, by executing this script task it will um, pop up the message window like hello world so for that how to write this here we will see the edit script button if we click here we have to write some code for this to display so how we are going to do that one we are going to see now so what that edit script window will be opening shortly so after that opening see here it has been opened here you can see this script page script page here in the main uh, in this main function we are going to write what we want to do here what i am going to do is i am using that variable and that hello world is going to pop up like a message window so for that i am going to use like message box dot show dts dot variables here i am going to pass those variable like user user variable what script script variable which i have passed dot value dot that is going to change to string i have closed this and semicolon see now if i run this it's going to take that value from this variable and it's going to message is a pop-up there i am saving the uh, and then next what i'm going to do is so hit ok over here So now if I run this, the pop-up window should be coming here. Let's see, hello world. So that is the message we have passed. I have been passed in this variable as a variable. So now this is script task by a variable we have finished. The next thing what I'm going to do is this script task. I'm going to pass the parameters like new, new package I have taken. And here in this new package, I am going to pass this new parameters. New SSIS package. See, now I am going to pass a parameter over here. Like about what the parameter, new parameter I am going to add as a script 
the same thing I am going to give script variable and this is of a type string and the value will be hello world so this parameter is over now I am going to drop and drop uh, my uh, script task Here I am going to drag and drop my script task. So after this, double click over here. And here we can see this read only variables. Now if you see the read, uh, read and write variables, we are not uh, going to see anything. Why? Because this is the parameters what we are going to pass that read only variables. What it's going to be here, you can see our my read only variables as a script variable. So I am going to take this one and I am going to edit that script. See again my window will be opening my edit script window there I am going to change that uh, message box how to write that message box over here to pass a, a parameter. So now it's the script task has been uh, opened. Now in the main function what I am going to write is message box dot show sorry show dts dot variables and Package script variable dot value dot to string. So this is a message box it's going to variable here the here what I have passed is as a parameters variable that is I have passed over here. So next thing I am going to hit OK. We have to press OK over here so that it will be updated. The edit script what is is going to be updated here. The code is written here. Now we can see this pop up window. Hello world. So this is how we have done here like I have passed through two variables like one is a variable how I have passed and the script task has been written through a variable and through a parameter passing. So in this video I have explained in a script task how to pass a variables of uh, variables and how to pass a parameters to our uh, script task. Thank you. Thank you for listening. If you like my video please subscribe and share my video. Thank you.